Hello. I wasn't going to record now, but I think I probably should just to kind of share how I'm feeling. Um, today's the last day. This is it. This is it. Last appointment until surgery. And so I guess the next film, the film, the next video <laughs> after this is going to be a video of me just recording the day before surgery, day of as much as I can and stuff like that. So maybe I'll also do like food stuff, like what I'll be having at home. I don't know. Anyway, um, let me see if I can put this down. Hold on. Okay, I don't know what's wrong with this. I'm gonna hold it. Um, yeah, today I've been a real big crybaby. I don't know why, but um, this morning and then just now before I turn this on. And I'm here at the doctor to take this two-hour class. It's before, it's an educational thing about maybe the surgery. Well, of course, the surgery. And I maybe prep stuff, so I don't know. But I don't know where this is coming from. Where is this coming from? Why am I having a problem now? I don't know. So I've been a real big crybaby. Um, I don't know why. But uh, I think it's just coming from like... A, oh my gosh, I don't know if I can take this daylight. Um, I think it's coming from a place of like anxiety. I think I'm feeling anxiety, anxiousness um, about the surgery, about other people I don't know what's going on I don't know why I'm getting so emotional and ridiculous over feeling the way I'm feeling I normally don't cry about things well I don't know maybe after have after having my daughter everything makes me cry I think but <laughs> but like I normally bottle up emotions and don't really I internalize a lot and don't really do the emotional crying thing in front of people and especially in front of my family because that's just you know I don't feel like I, I don't know it just it's weird and I don't know if anybody else feels this way or you know it's like your family does support you you know my family supports me but I feel like I don't know I don't really want to talk about the surgery too much with them how I'm feeling what's going on and so I internalize it and then it comes out in other forms. I'll be like driving and music is playing. And all of a sudden I'm like, oh, like, okay. Like, <laughs> I don't know. So yeah, I mean, I'm excited. I'm really excited about the surgery. I'm so thankful. Um, I just feel, um, what time is it? I just feel like <sighs> the anxiety of the whole, why is this door not? The anxiety of the whole process is starting to get to me a little bit. And um, it'll be fine. I'll be fine. But I don't know. I just feel like I had to get this out of my system and discuss it. All right. So I'm here in the parking lot of the doctor's office. Okay. Where is my... And I have like... A little under half an hour before the class begins so I wanted to get myself a little more presentable before we go in and uh, I don't know I'm excited I'm excited I guess anxious all these things that people get which is all normal and fine I don't know why I'm getting so um upset like why am i getting so emotional what's going on in here what's happening i don't know but i guess people who've gone through this process will understand what i'm saying maybe or maybe they'll be like lady calm down it's not that serious i don't know um yeah i don't know if this helps or not <laughs> so anyway I definitely want to be recording a lot when 
the day before surgery happens so that I can talk about how I'm feeling then. Maybe I'll be just fine and normal and not like a big crybaby like I am today. Or maybe I'll be a mess and you'll get to witness that. And you know, the only thing that keeps me from, the only thing that, um, what do I want to say? Doesn't stop me from putting up how I'm feeling is the fact that there's only a handful of people who are watching this video. So it's not like hundreds of thousands of people are going to see me like, Ooh, you know, I mean, maybe someday, I don't know. But for now, it's just a little handful of us. So, you know, I'm thankful. I'm thankful. Because I think if I had like oodles of subscribers, I'd be like, I can't talk about this. No, I don't know. I'm pretty open, I think, about the way I feel in general. And I think what's surprising is that normally it's like I'm, I'm the person that's like, ah! And you'll see it like the videos just before this one, the clips before this one. I'm more, I think, I've, at least I feel like I'm more upbeat. And now I feel like I'm kind of like mm, sulking. I don't know. So, yeah, I just feel like I can share. And what I'm not sharing with my family right now or ever probably because I just don't like to be like deep and like, Oh, I feel so sad and I need hugs and blah, blah, blah. I, um, I'd rather just say it here on a video. I don't know. It's more public, I guess, but than just telling your family. But I don't know. It's weird. I feel like I can just talk right now and open up. And you know what? I think that sometimes when people that are on videos talk about the way they're feeling and another person can relate, it's nice because at least you know you're not alone in how you're feeling. So this is exactly, you guys, one week, one week until surgery. And that's really exciting. One week until surgery. I can't believe it. I feel like it's been forever. And it's funny because I was looking at my old videos. And I think this started out like nine months ago when I was like, hey, guess what? Here's my intro. And now we're nine months out and I'm ready for surgery next week. When I get out of the doctor's office, I'm going to try to get on here again just to give it a last touch of what happened? What did we talk about? And for those of you who live in South Florida and are looking for a good doctor to help you with this process, if you're interested in it, I'll definitely be posting that later on. Um, and you can come along over here. So anyway, thank you for listening. I really appreciate it. Hello. I know it looks weird, right? It's the sun. Let me try to move it over here. Okay, so um, the class is over. Woohoo! Yeah, I'm so happy. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. So basically, I'm kind of back to my peppy self. I think being in the class kind of eased my anxiety some, and then there was like 15 of us in there. So that was pretty cool. I met somebody today that is going to have the surgery on the same day at the same place as I am. That's part of, you know, one of the people in the group. And oh my goodness, we're so excited and we're ready for this, you know, step. It's kind of nice to have somebody there that's going through the same thing. So that's kind of cool. And then um, they basically just went through everything, like the medications you're gonna need, the vitamins you're gonna need, how you're going to be eating after, what to expect, those kinds of things. And so that was fine. And then, uh, yeah, so I'm really okay right now and I'm um, looking forward to what's to come, continuing my diet and um, yeah, I'll see if um, before I can kind of put together some of the things I've purchased for afterwards as far as like foods. foods. <laughs> and um, yeah, thank you for watching again. I've said that probably a hundred times because I've done like a bunch of clips. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Say hi. 
um, any advice from anyone who's gone through the sleeve before a revision before anything like that please leave your comments I really could use it and it's nice to have encouragement and support so thank you very much bye